Happy Tuesday, everybody. Joe for Jaspi's CaseBreaks.com coming at you with 2019 Panini Spectra Football four box half case. Pick your team number 20 from Jaspi's CaseBreaks.com. 20 actually, it's from a fresh case. 20 actually filled before 19. So thanks to everybody who got into break number 20, our first break of the Tuesday. Big thanks to Mark Matheson who got a good chunk of the teams last. So he has those little last bought mojo stars next to his name. Thanks for getting into it. Appreciate everybody getting into the Spectra breaks. Looks like we did a ton over the weekend. So thanks every uh, thanks everyone for getting into it, and making it happen. All right, so fresh case. Let's pop it open. And let's see which half we're going to do. So we'll go one, two, three for the left side, four, five, six for the right side. And it's three. We'll go one, two, three right here. So this side. We'll reserve for break number 19. All right, and I'll use this blank card to slow play the hits a little bit. Good luck, everybody. Here we go. Like I said, we'll use that blank card to slow play of the hits. There's Kyler Murray. 18 out of 60. So far, so good. I feel like with Kyler Murray's career, he's been putting up some nice numbers. Maybe needs to lock in a win or two, but I think that's hashtag good for the hobby. Thirty-three out of fifty. There's Leonard Fournette. Nice high voltage jersey. Going out to the Kyler Murray goes to Chris Hansen and the Cardinals, and Michael Gallucci with the Jaguars in this one. that white bounce a little bit. All right, next up we got Max Impact, Anthony Miller for the Bears. That jersey going to Mark Glassman. And then we've got Jalen Hurd for the Niners. Rookie auto for Jordan and the Niners. Jimmy Garoppolo looking great over the weekend. 49 out of 99 for the 49ers. All right, let's go to this side right here. There's Le'Veon Bell, 17 out of 30. Neon green die cut. They're just going to be riding him for a while. They lose Sam Darnold to Mono. 
They lose Trevor Simeon in the game. And he just destroyed ligaments. And now it's Luke Falk. Quarterback for the Jets now. And Le'Veon Bell. Michael Gallucci with the Jets. So dust off your Luke Falk autographs. Another one. Another Le'Veon Bell for Michael. To 20. We've got rising rookie, Meikle Hardman Jr. That'll be for the Chiefs, who took care of my Raiders pretty easily. Jordan with the Chiefs to 99. He had a, Meikle Hardman Jr. had like a 70 some odd yard touchdown taken away due to a penalty. And we got Hakeem Butler, two color patch and neon green autograph. For the Redbirds, Chris Hansen with the Cardinals. Who've been looking okay. Not as bad as maybe some people thought they'd be. There's Andy Isabella, Hakeem's teammate, to 99. There is, wow, of, out of five, Andy Isabella. So that's a train whistle for Chris Hansen and the Cardinals. Five out of five. And all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop whoop. Nice. And Max Impact, Calvin Ridley. I think who uh, looked pretty good against the Eagles on Sunday. Sixty-five out of ninety-nine for Michael Gallucci and the Dirty Birds. The autograph. It's a dual relic, dual auto for the Vikings. Irv Smith Jr., Alexander Mattison, and that goes to Damian Stock and the Minnesota Vikings. Twenty-one out of thirty. And the final pack here. Got Todd Gurley. 44 out of 50 die cut for the Rams. That goes to Matheson. Not to be confused with this guy. They may be related, though. Todd Gurley looked all right. Rams cruised against the Saints. Saints losing Drew Brees for six to eight weeks, uh, tearing ligaments in his thumb. His hand hit Aaron Donald's big paw. There's Masked Marvels, Marcus Mariota. Titans, Mark Livingston with that. Sixteen out of thirty. We have Benny Snell Jr. It's another team that lost a quarterback. Dust off your uh, Mason Rudolph cards, everyone. Michael Gallucci with the Steel Curtain. The Steelers. Thirty seven out of one ninety nine. And the autograph here is DK Metcalf, who's been looking pretty good in his rookie campaign as well. Travis Melberg with the Seahawks. Nice rising rookie auto. 91 out of 99. Box three. Well, so what happens, folks? What happens in the NFC South? Does Saints losing Drew Brees, what does that do? Who does that help? Could they still make the playoffs with Teddy Bridgewater? Maybe. NFC South. I mean, the... I guess the Falcons could take advantage of it if they, if they get their act together. Panthers could take advantage of it, but Cam Newton just doesn't seem healthy. He's got that foot issue. Could the Buccaneers take advantage of, of, of a breezeless Saints? And what about the Steelers in the AFC North? 
two out of 50. They lose Ben Roethlisberger. Elbow injury, non-contact elbow injury, which is usually not a good sign. He's out for the season. They're 0-2. But does that mean the Ravens cruise? Cleveland Browns have one less team to worry about for the playoffs. There's James Conner, Michael Kluge, or do the Steelers. I don't think got Minka Fitzpatrick. Jimmy Garoppolo looked great over the weekend. One out of five. And that's Jordan with the Niners. One out of five. And all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! Niners looking good, and folks. Aren't the Niners are two and zero? Oh. Believe it or not, I went to a wedding, Rex. All my friends were there, so was, I just thought it, I just figured it was for me. Afterburners. Tariq Cohen. Twenty-two out of ninety-nine Bears. That'll be for Boombox. So Augustus is saying he would love to see the Panthers get their ish together. I, that's that's that that'll be based on uh, that'll all be based on Cam Newton's health. If he's healthy, he's great. But if he's banged up, if he's limited, that's trouble. There's Devin Bush the second rookie auto for Michael Gallucci and the Steelers. This may just be a transitional year for the Steelers. Augustus also saying the Ravens will be gaining from the from the Steelers losing Ben Rosper. That's for sure. And the shape of the league changing just just at the drop of a quarterback. There's Joey Bosa, Sean with the Chargers. Chargers banged up too. Missing key pieces on the defense. Key pieces on the offense. Not looking good in Detroit. Out of 60, Joey Bosa. Yes, Cam Newton is extremely questionable this week. Foot did not practice today. There's Jerome Bettis, 18 out of 25. He's in a new Geico commercial. Epic Legends, three color, which is kind of funny. Three color jersey. I enjoyed it. Michael Gallucci with that one. So as Cam Newton, Cam Newton goes, the, the Panthers go. There's Chris Godwin, Max Impact. Do the Buccaneers, can they take advantage of Drew Brees and the Saints? Or Drew Brees being without, not on the Saints for at least six to eight weeks. It's dependent on Jameis Winston, I think. And there's two-color patch and neon green ink autograph Alexander Mattison. Packers taking care of business against the Minnesota Vikings. Packers are at home. Generally do pretty well there. 24 out of 50. Got Terry Bradshaw to 99. Steel curtain, that one. Greg, first time buyer, thank you. Where can I find a schedule of break times? There's no real schedule at the moment. Well, I can tell you that the second half of this is breaking right after this. But after that, there's really no schedule for anything. It's just whenever it fills, it breaks. Whenever that spot's left number drops to zero, then that's the next one we're doing. We just go in order. First to fill, first to break. There's Rookie Aura, Benny Snell Jr. There's Max Impact, Jadavion Clowney. Still Texans edition here, Michael Wilson. And now Clowney's got a bruised shoulder. At a 199. And we've got Jarrett Sidham. Jersey and white out ink autograph. That's a good looking one for the Patriots. Mike Luongo with the Pats. Do the Pats go 16 and 0, ladies and gentlemen? And do the Dolphins go 0 and 16? There's 4 out of 10, Jarrett Sidham. Patriots look so good, especially that defense. Granted, you know, they're playing the Dolphins, but still.
Miles Garrett, 5 out of 15. I think he was the guy that that knocked Trevor Simeon out of the game. Boombox with the Browns. For my Raiders, rising rookie dual relic Hunter Renfro. Raiders did what they expected that they would do against the Chiefs. Stay strong for a little bit. Look like they're going to hang around. And then the Chiefs did Chiefs things. Dropped 28 on them in one quarter. They didn't score any points after that. Before or after. That's all it took. Oh, there's Drew Brees. Pillars of the game. Drew Brees. Not out as long as Big Ben. Drew Brees only out six to eight weeks. But let's see what the Saints can do over the next six to eight weeks. 91 out of 99. And we got J.J. Arcega Whiteside. Deshaun Jackson, I think, is going to be out for a couple weeks. Maybe J.J. Arcega Whiteside steps up for the Fly Eagles Fly. That'll be for Steven Olsen. Yeah, losing Jonathan Abram for the season was pretty rough. You're welcome, Steve. Good start to the day. Two boxes to go. Yeah, losing losing Jonathan Abram safety for the Raiders was not good. And it, Raiders secondary was already a bit of their the kind of their not their strong suit. <coughs> it's definitely excuse me, it was definitely a weakness for them. So So now losing him and, you know, facing an offense like the Chiefs. I guess the score could have been worse. I thought the offense would do, work, run a little bit better, though. Car throwing those, those picks were, were not good. Steve Olsen, will Nick put more on the site? There's plenty, isn't there? Are you not entertained? Got tons of stuff on the site. Plenty to do tonight and even more to do tomorrow. There's Ray Lewis to 99. Well, Gary Ann Conley can't do it by himself. Gill cards. There's Mass Marvel's Russell Wilson, Neon Pink. There's Oh, there's tons that can break tonight, Steve Olson. You're just not looking hard enough on jazbeescasebreaks.com. We've got Futera Baseball, number 12. We've got a full case random team break of Panini Contenders Draft Picks Basketball, Zion Hunting. we got Pop Century. we got Premier Hockey. we got Fanatics Autographed Jerseys. Tons. There's Russell Wilson. And uh, for Travis Melberg, Russell Wilson, Andy Isabella, rookie patch and autograph for Chris Hansen and the Cardinals. Yeah, he was kind of beating on it. Well, I mean, he's facing the Chiefs. What are you going to do? I think there's a there's going to be three quarters of the league, if not more, <laughs> are going to be beat on every play by Mahomes and that and that offense. And there's Max Impact Carson Wentz. He was missing some tools on Sunday. We got Tremaine Edmonds. Oh, Steve Olson wants football related stuff for tonight. No, but why not pre order for tomorrow and be part of the pre order promo, Steve Olson, on jazbeescasebreaks.com? Pre order XR, pre order Flaws Collegiate Football. Made Edmonds goes to David Duffy and the Bills and be part of the pre-order promo tonight. Try to win some break credit. Then he joins tomorrow for a ton of football. Boom. There's Todd Gurley in his Pro Bowl gear. 17 out of 35. Yes, I, I hate Mahomes as well, and it's just pure jealousy. <laughs> pure jealousy. 
That's for Mark Madsen and the Rams. We got 67 out of 99, Benny Snell Jr., Radiant, Relic, and Autograph. Young guy's got to step up, Michael Gulucci and the Steelers, his Steelers. Just next man up. That's correct, Pirate. All breaks are listed on the website, jaspiescasebreaks.com. There's the website right there. Just type that in. Or right above my head. There it is right there. Andy Isabella, 178 out of 199. Monumental relic. I guess the relic is on the bottom in this box. Usually it's the autograph on the bottom of each pack. All right, so Andy Isabella goes to uh, Chris Hansen. We got DeAndre Hopkins coming into focus right there. There you go, 54 out of 60 for the Texans. Michael Wilson. We've got Mac Wilson, return of the Mac. Mark Glassman with the Browns. Browns taking care of business against a weakened Jets team last night. Two out of 50, They're trying to get into gear there. Still too many penalty yards, I feel like. Super Bowl champion autograph, that's Keyshawn Johnson. Nice one for the Buccaneers. That goes to, is that Alex Lindsay with the Bucks? Yeah, there you go, Alex. Keyshawn does morning uh, radio, morning, morning local radio here in Los Angeles. It's a pretty popular show. I'm never awake early enough for it, but I hear it's good. Three out of 15. Obi-Wan, what's going on? And there's a Jerry Rice relic. Milestone moments, 1,848 yards in 1995. And that was back in the day we can just blow up receivers all the time. Sixteen out of fifty. Thanks, Gil. We try. Gil saying it's been a while since I got a break with Jaspies, but you guys make box breaking fun. It should be fun. It's, it is fun. Who doesn't make it fun? Are there people that are not having fun doing this? Open up trading cards for a living. Four out of ten die cut. How could it not be fun? Mark Luongo with the Patriots, the Pat Riots. There's P, smiley face P, Preston Williams, Dolphins. Mark Masson on the board with the Dolphins. Some people are just boring. Thankfully, we're not just some people. 006 out of 199. There is Nikhil Harry, Triple Relic and Autograph. Another Patriot for Mike. Eleven out of one ninety-nine. And then we've got Afterburners, Cooper Cub. Yeah, Cooper Cub making a big difference in that that Rams offense. Who I still think are just I mean, I guess. For all those teams who are really committed to not playing their starters in the preseason, like the Rams, I mean, the first couple weeks, first two, three weeks of the season are pretty much like preseason. Teams like the Rams. All right, final box. This is Pick Your Team 20, which filled before Pick Your Team 19. So Pick Your Team 19 is, going, is coming up next. We kind of went out of order, but that's okay. First to fill, first to break on jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks, Doug. Yeah, that's the idea. Uh, we're, we're, we're trying to create some content as well. I mean, anyone can just open up boxes of cards, right? But I don't know. You're, spend, you're spending a lot of your valuable time during your day to stare at our faces. We, might, we may as well do what we... Talk about what we like talking about. Sports, maybe mix in a little bit of movies, music, all sorts of stuff. Some flower seeds.
All right. One day we'll be sponsored by a sunflower seed company. Oh, man. That'll be the day. Anthony Munoz for the Bengals. Nine out of 60. Can't quite figure out the Bengals this year, folks. What are, what are we thinking about them? They looked more than competitive in Seattle, in Seattle, in week one. Always a tough place to go, but then just get smoked by the Niners at home. Not sure how I feel about that. Bengals, Mark Matheson. Max Impact, Richard Sherman. There are the Niners right there. Looking good. Garoppolo looking good. Offense looking good. Jordan with the Niners. 93 out of 199. What we got? What time is it? Game time. Ray Lewis. 2,500 career tackles. Mark Livingston with the Ravens. Yeah, Addison saying, man, Joe Mixon, Mike Evans really screwing fantasy up for me. Come on, guys. And there's Darius Slay, 17 out of 50. Autograph for the Lions. Travis Melberg with the Lions. We've got a W at home against the Chargers over the weekend. Uh-oh, Gil. Split household, huh? Why The wife is a Niners fan and you're a Raiders guy. There's Debo Samuel. 39 out of 50. Is there that big of a... See, I, you know, obviously my Raiders fandom comes from their association with Southern California, with L.A. But I don't know the Raiders as, are they really, is that really a big rivalry? 39 out of 50, Debo Samuel, die cut. In different conferences, they rarely play each other, right? There's Bradley Chubb, neon pink, five out of 25, brutal loss for the Broncos. Brian Langley with the Broncos. AJ Anderson says, Gil, the wife's got to go. AJ says, my girl is a Packers fan. She'd be gone. That's it? Just like that? I'm thinking, I'm thinking that if, uh, if that girl happened to be maybe a Victoria's Secret model, I think you'd look the other way if she was a Packers fan. Maybe not. I don't know. I'd be impressed if you were just like, don't care. Victoria's Secret model, not. Get out of here. You're done. Packers fan, get out. Meagle Harmon Jr. Jumbo relic there out of 199. Monumental relic to be more precise. Oh, there you go. Oh, okay, so you're, you're a Raiders fan due to LA. Due to LA uh, association as well. There's Randall Cunningham. Nice. That is three out of 25. That goes to uh, Stephen Olsen and the Eagles. Nice one, Steve. Oh, AJ throwing some shade, saying no Packers fan looks like a model. Woo! There's Cleland Farrell, 39 out of 99. So Gil has two girls, though, but and they're both split on team. A house divided. Gill, during the fall, during the football season, a house divided. Thankfully, you're on the Dodger side of things, though. I appreciate that. 39 out of 99, Cleveland Farrell for my Raiders. Got Max Impact, DJ Shark, do, 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 do. 10 out of 10, Max Impact, DJ Shark, Michael Gallucci, and the Jaguars.
And we got Lawrence Taylor, 20 and a half sacks in 1986. A lot of sacks. And that goes to the New York Football Giants, who's going with Daniel Jones this week, ladies and gentlemen. James Long and Giants, dust off your Daniel Jones cards. I'm rooting for him. Maybe hashtag good for the hobby. That is faux show. 49 out 75. Any guesses on this redemption? Bragging rights? AJ saying, man, yeah, that is kind of cold, right, Gil? AJ saying Danica was the only decent looking Packers fan. She's getting cute. Man, brutal. Brutal. AJ, why don't you let people know where you're from? <laughs> Howie Long. Five out of 20. Die cut. Neon pink die cut going for David Duffy and the Raiders. And the team you support, AJ Anderson. Maybe, maybe, maybe uh, Green Bay Packers fans want to crack back. There's rookie Aura, Kyler Murray. He's playing well. Two out of thirty. Hey guys. Two out of 30. Uh, the Raiders' Howie Long goes to David Duffy. Uh, Chris with the Cardinals that gets the Kyler Murray. Damian Harris goes to Mike and the Pat Riots. Doug March guessing Paris Campbell as the redemption. That's a good guess. He's not signing his cards. Can't be that busy. And back here is Irv Smith Jr., 17 out of 50. Two-color patch and neon green ink autograph. That goes to Damien and the Vikings. And the Redemption. We have aspiring patch autographs. David Montgomery for the Bears. <laughs> I wasn't even noticing the chat. All right, and that is for Boombox and the Bears. And there you go, folks. That was Picker Team 20. Wait, who called? Did AJ call it? Oh, yeah, he said Montgomery earlier. There you go. Nice. And there you have it, folks. Picker Team 20 in the book. Let's give away some money. Oh, yeah, Danny Jones. I know, Danny Jones is starting. That's hashtag good for the hobby. I don't know the lyrics to that song. Uh, David Duffy, you have at least two. That gets you one entry in the break credit promo. Jordan, you have three. If you had four, you'd get two entries, but it's all good. You still get an entry. Glassman gets an entry. Livingston gets an entry. Matheson got seven. So six are eligible. So that means three get you entries, three entries. Michael Gallucci got four, he gets two. Michael Wilson got two, he gets one. And Travis Melberg got two, he gets one. All right, so there's 11. One spot out of the 11 is gonna get $50 of break credit. Let's roll it and randomize it five times, three and a two. One, two, three, four, and fifth and final time. Name on top is going to be Mark Matheson. He certainly had the odds. He gets $50 of break credit. Thank you, Mark. Thanks, everyone, for getting in. The next break coming up after this, jazbeescasebreaks.com.